Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I want to learn how to create callouts in Revit. Yes, Revit callouts. In Revit callouts, you can call out a particular aspect of your floor plan. Maybe this last plan that I have here, you can call out a particular aspect so that I can detail it properly. So that is the advantage of callout. This last plan has some details on the floor plan that you might not be able to you might not be able to view. But when you call it, call it out, you can be able to dimension and, and show more details about that particular area. So let's go straight to it. So on call out, go to views, call out. I prefer using rectangular or you can use sketch to sketch out the boundary of the call out. So let's use rectangle call out. Here, call out, call out this space. You can move the node here. You can move it here. You can adjust it to whatever you want. Yeah, let's just leave it that way. Okay. All right. So let's go straight to callout. So this is the boundary of the callout. Just double click here. It will bring out the callout view. So as you can see, this is still a floor plan, but it's showing just a part of the floor plan that I call out. You can extend this. Yeah. Extend this boundary because of your detail, your keynotes, the dimension, and whatever every other detail you want to have. But I prefer putting off adding the crop region. For you to start detailing it, you can start with visibility graphics. You can watch my previous videos on how to use visibility graphics for your floor plans, your elevation, and all that aspects of the drawing. So let me go to the visibility graphics. Let's just change that. Okay. Alright, so you can see the line the wall lines are thicker. So you can also change that to so brick brick, yeah. So these are the things you can do the dimension. Um let's say let me use this. Okay. So from here you can dimension whatever part you want to dimension that you might not be able to dimension on the general floor plan and that's the idea you can detail out your call out if you have done your keynote element call out okay as you can see i have a call out notes for this okay you can watch my previous video on how to create keynotes in revit yeah so Let's create another one. Let's say go to the floor plan view. Let me say this second area. Double click on that. Okay. So repeat the same process for like the first one. So thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and watch my previous videos on Revit. Thank you.